Hey guys, what's going on? It's JMT, and if I sound depressed, it's because I am. Hey guys, what's going on? It's JMT, and welcome to a Zombie Stories video where we're going to be doing some unboxing today. I got some requests to go ahead and do some unboxing in Zombie Stories because um, I don't know why, but we're, we're going to do that today. As you guys can see, if we go to the shop, we have over 100,000 Z-Bucks. So with the primary boxes being 1,000 Z-Bucks, we're going to be opening over 100 of these primary boxes. 101 to be exact. Hopefully we don't open 100, get nothing good, and then the last one will be something good because that would make me want to burn someone's house down. And trust me, I'm not that crazy yet. So if we go to the primary box and we go to inspect and we filter all, we have all of these lovely possible choices to go ahead and get um, these items inside of that crate. My goal for this video is to unbox one mythic weapon here. So let's go ahead and get started with today's unboxing. Let's start with box number one. I can already see a rare. I already see a rare. It's the pumpkin persuader. And I just saw a mythic. The first box, we were that close to getting a mythic. It wasn't the greatest mythic, but it was a, it was a mythic. Second box here, I see a rare, and I also saw a mythic again. I don't know if you go ahead and actually see those in all of these boxes. Um, I don't I don't think you do. Some boxes, when you open up these primary boxes, I know for a fact that you don't even see the um, you don't see a mythic. You don't even see a rare. You just see the greens and the blues. But as of right now, the ones that we're opening up so far, I'm actually seeing, I actually saw like quite a bit of rares and mythics. But as you can see, like this box, for example, there's not going to be anything good because you could already see it while we're opening it. It is a 1% chance to go ahead and actually get a mythic when you're unboxing. So in theory, if we open up a hundred of these, we should be getting at least one mythic. We're going to go ahead and see if that's actually the case today. Because if it is 1%, we're going to be testing that. We should be getting a bunch of weapons, though, that I don't need that we can combine and make them rares. So that'll be cool to see. We got a mythic and we got a rare inside of this box. Oh, boy. And it was the steampunk, too. Okay. I don't really use... Because that steampunk would have been for the recon class. And I don't really like using the sniper too much inside of this game. I'm more of like a... I think I main medic. I pretty much just main medic, nothing else really. So like if we could get, possibly if we could get a jack carbine, possibly if we could get, you know, a jack carbine mythic, that would be pretty cool. Like the vaporwave one, the one that's like very good. I'm pretty sure all vaporwave skins inside of this game are just extremely rare. So if we could, uh, if we could pop one of those, that would be amazing. We've already gone through 10 boxes though so far. So we're one tenth of the way here. I was going to say here and there at the same time. And I kind of just said like hair, like a rabbit. Oh boy, we are getting a bunch of greens. So after we do go ahead and actually open up all these primary boxes as well though, guys, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll keep recording to the aftermath of me going ahead and combining all the weapons to see what rares we can get because we should be getting a bunch of rares when we're opening all these because you can combine five blues into one rare and a rare, by the way, is the orange type weapons and those have like their own specific skins or effects and stuff like that, which is why I'm, I'm hyped to go ahead and actually get a bunch of those. So we are guaranteed just some of those in general from all of these blues and greens that we're getting. But so far, through the 14 boxes that we've opened, we've only gotten greens and blues. I see a mythic. Ooh, but we're not going to be getting it, unfortunately. A blue granite M1 carbine. I'm not going to be using that. You're definitely going to be getting scrapped there, buddy. Another crate with just green and blues. Heated snow camo is probably my uh, most favorite blue item. We do have a bunch of those in the inventory, so we got a uh, a mythic there. But no, unfortunately, we're going to be getting the white MP5. Who loves that? No one. Pretty sure no one here. Guys, put your hands down. We got the massacre camo. I just saw a massacre camo for a rare. Another mythic. And I think it's a wire camo. It was. It was a wire ACR. Another... Ooh. Heated snow camo. Okay, I'll take it. Those wire camos, even though I don't like the way they look, for some reason they're very pricey. People love to trade them wire ACRs. Or just any wire weapon in general. Because I think there's more than one. It's not just a wire ACR. I'm, I'm pretty certain there's other wire skins for uh, assault weapons, that is. The pink og. I'll take pink weapons. People love the pink weapons. We got a rare in this one. I think it's the it's the ice. It's an ice camo, ice ACR. But nope, we're not gonna be getting that. The burnt burnt sienna persuader. 
Okay, shotgun. Uh, I don't see anything good in this crate either. Ooh, I would have loved to get another heated snow camo. I'll be collecting those for sure. Ooh, there were two. Oh, an umbral AK-47 would have been a great grab. That would have been nice to land on. Unfortunately, though, we will not be getting that. This will be 24th case here. A toy wingmaster. How about we uh, throw you in the trash? This box right here will be one-fourth of the way done in today's unboxing. And we haven't gotten anything too good yet. Besides, for blues, just the heated snow camo. Anxiety RPK. I see two mythics. I think I saw, nope, just one mythic. I don't think we'll be getting one though. No, it was a um, galaxy. I think it was a galaxy M14. I think that's what it was. Galaxy weapons, I don't mind either. So they're not really the best of the best in the mythic category along with the gold, but I don't mind a galaxy weapon. The red G21C. Got a rare in this, and I think it was a massacre weapon. Yeah, it's a massacre, a massacre scar. Cyan Granite Lee Enfield. Another rare in this one. Oh, and this is a rare that I really want, but I don't think we're going to be getting it. The uh, the one rare that I really want is the Gamma Ray MP5. That's one that I've had my eyes on for a while. I can get it right now just going through trading. I just overpaid a bunch for a Jack Carbine because for some reason this thing is hyped up right now. But the Gamma Ray, love to go ahead and get that on my list. So if we can get it out of just unboxing here, that'd be pretty cool. I actually, I see a Jack Carbine right there. Ooh, just one away from the Ice Persuader. I saw a Jack, a, a uh, Shiroko, or a Shear. I call it the Shear, the Jack Carbine. That gets overpaid a bunch right now. There were two rares in here, the Massacre M4. We are getting like a one away from these great weapons, but we're not actually getting one. Another rare, unfortunately, getting the Ruger. Probably the worst weapon in the game. Um, we got a Mythic here. Not gonna be landing on it, though. We got the Ice MP5. So this is the first rare out of the, uh, whole dealio today. So after 34 crates, we finally got a rare, and it's the Ice MP5. I don't really like the Ice weapons in the game, but, um, I will take it. It'll definitely be, like, a filler item inside of trading. I don't think anyone's gonna go ahead and trade specifically for an ice weapon. I mean, I think some people do that with the shotguns. If someone, like, if I'm trading for an item and they just want, like, rares, um, we'll go ahead and just use those as filler items. But I highly doubt, like I said, anyone will go for an ice. There was two mythicals in that crate, like, side by side. One was a vaporwave, too, I think. Ooh. Jack Carbine there. People love the Jack Carbines. There was a... I think it was the beach jack carbine. We got a rare here as well. Two rares. Yeah, those are two different rares. Gray PPSH. We have yet to get a mythic. I'm counting on a mythic in today's unboxing. Again, two rares inside of this crate as well. Three. There was a long ride uh, MP5 up there. I saw a Massacre M4. Can we land on the Massacre M4? Nope. We get the MK18. Oh, there's that gold again. That was like the first one, like the first box that we opened. It was the gold Winchester. We were one away from it again, just like the first box. Nothing good inside of this crate. The hot dog, a hot dog skin. I'm not even gonna lie. Didn't know that was a skin inside of this game. Two or three rares inside of this crate. Ooh, we won't land on that though, which I'm glad. Really did not like that rare. Oh, there's a very nice, I think that's the cyber. There's a cyber gun in here. The cyber arc, we were, I think we were two away. We're gonna land on the snow camo. I think there's a vapor wave in here. Yeah, that was a vapor wave weapon. Vapor wave HK, but we won't be getting it. We are almost halfway through opening all these boxes. Another green and blue crate. Another great PPSH. We got a lot of PPSHs. So, um, as you guys, if you guys have seen, I did do a video on this game um, a couple of days ago. It was on the new update, the Dead Ahead. We completed that um, doing the both endings. So we completed it doing both endings. And um, ever since then, I've literally been playing this game in my off time. I've been obsessed with it. So I've been going into trading quite a bit. I've been literally just been joining lobbies and sitting there and just trading with people. If the lobby goes ahead and gets dead, I'll go ahead and switch and go into a different lobby and just continue trading. I 
only join their Discord for the sole purpose of looking up a value list and finding other people who are also trading inside this game. For some reason, it is very fun to me. Just like in the off time of not recording or editing a video, just doing this is amazing. So I, this is why um, another reason we're going ahead and doing a big unboxing today to show you guys if we actually do get a Mythic out of the primary box for opening over a hundred of them. And uh, just so I kind of have some inventory to go ahead and keep trading in that game. But that right there was 50 crates that we opened. So we are half halfway through opening all this and we have yet to get a mythic so we got 51 more chances to get a mythic inside of this box Ooh, one away from a tron scar if we don't get a mythic i would like to get three rares because right now the comparison for most mythic weapons to get people are taking like three to five rares or something like that so if i can go ahead and get like three rares in the game just at least that would be amazing for this unboxing because then that right there would pretty much prove that you're getting a mythic. Not a high tier mythic, but definitely a low tier one. But again, I will take anything, of course. We got quite a bit of mythics in this crate. There was two of them there. The gold M4 and the other one was a wire. Another mythic, but I don't know what that one is. That was a cyber... Over, over, overdrive or cyber drive. Another green and blue crate. Fine by me. Build them up. Build up the inventory for this specific color. So we can get them rares. Ooh, another mythic in the crate. Will we be able to get it? No, we will not. That was a steampunk. You can tell pretty much when you're not going to get a mythic by the way it passes with how much time is left in the unboxing. Like right there, that candy girl, we're not getting that just because it was already slowing down and we passed it during that time. Ooh, there's an orange jack carbine, which I can buy right there. One away from the orange jack carbine. I could get it for 4.5 right now, but what's the point of that when you could be opening these boxes and get a chance at a mythic? There's two mythics in here, a gold UMP5 and another one was like a, was that an AK? I don't know. Here we go. 60 crates in white mp5 i just gave that gun to a friend today to use another green and blue crate desert camo persuader i think this is another green and blue crate i don't see anything in here a julius jack carbine i'll be keeping that i don't think i'll combine that into anything if i'm going to collect any type of blue it's definitely going to be a heated snow camos and those carbines the uh, jack ones here we go all right we got a rare haven't seen a rare in the three crates But we got the Cherry AK-47. Don't see anything in this one either. We got to get a Mythic. We got to. Mythic is on the chart for today. This is another green and blue crate. I'm sort of excited to see what rares we're going to get at the end of this unboxing. Very excited for that part. Because we should be getting quite a bit of rares, I think. I'd have to go ahead and see how many we can get, but you gotta combine five weapons to go ahead and make a rare, and they gotta be in the blue category as well. But we should have quite a bunch of them. I think so anyways. We got the Cyber Arc. All right, so that is a rare right there. We got the Cyber Arc 3. I was not expecting to get that. There must have been two Cyber Arcs in that chest because they must have been popping up quite a bit. All right, so so far we got two rares, and the rest have been green and blues. So if we can get one more rare in this unboxing or a mythic, I will be a happy camper. We are 71 crates in. So that means we have 30 more to go ahead and open here. I see another ice gun. I think it's the ice MP7 and the shotgun. Yeah. Ooh, and there's another one. It was the ice persuader. See a rare and then this one. I can't see what it is though. The It's a sunburst scar. Hey, heated snow camo. Alrighty. Holy lord, this one has a bunch of imagine if we don't land on a rare. If we don't land on a rare in this in this crate. There we go. The pink Lee infield. Not really a rare I would like, but hey, we got three rares in this unboxing so far. And we got 27 more crates to open, so that is good news. There are a bunch of rares in that one, dude. Okay, so now I am a happy camper. I really don't care what we get inside of these crates now, because we got three rares which uh, technically makes up for a, a low-tier mythic. This crate also has a bunch of rares. But we won't be getting any of them. Get the flush PPSH. Some of them green skins, I won't lie, look way cooler than some of these uh, these blue skins. And the green skins are the, the bottom of the bottom tier. That crate had a mythic as well, but I was not looking at it directly. We got two rares side-by-side side in this crate. 
I didn't see what they were though. One was a pink weapon. Nothing inside of this crate. A bunch of greens. I'm assuming we'll be getting a green. Yeah, we get a bunch of greens. The scar. Ooh, I think I saw the sunburst scar. And I think there's... Nope, just one sunburst scar. Abstract M1 Carbine. That's a very cool skin for the M1 Carbine. Again, for the recon class though. Not a weapon I would use. I'm more of the uh, MP5 type of guy. SMGs in general. But Jack Carbines can also be used with medics. And that is awesome, because it's like an assault rifle for the medic. Another sunburst scar. Yeah. Been a lot of sunburst scars. I saw the gamma ray! The gamma ray MP5 is inside of this crate. Can we get it? No, we can't. We were too away from the gamma ray. Maybe we might get a gamma ray for, uh, combining. That would be very cool. There is a... I don't even know what that weapon was. The lightning ultimix 100. One away from that one. Ice MP5. Ice MP7. Yeah, we got the War MP5. All right. Oh, what does this one have? I saw a Pumpkin Persuader, Sunburst Scar. Oh, almost a Sunburst Scar. There were three rares in that one. This one's another blue and green. Toy Wingmaster. That's our second one, I think. And a Thompson. That's also our second one. We get a lot of dupes in uh, in these crates, which is expected for opening a hundred of these bad boys. Over a hundred. A hundred and one. Uh -huh. The Desert M4. We got the Mythic. I see it. It's a galaxy. It's a galaxy infield. We won't be getting it though, unfortunately. We got 11 more crates to go ahead and open. Can we get a Mythical? We've gotten three rares so far. This has a Candy Girl in it, but we won't be getting it. Cherry AK-47, another dupe, of course. 10 more boxes to open to get a Mythical. The Orange Ruger, another duplicate. This one has two Mythics in it side by side. It was a gold AK, and I didn't see what the other one was. The Cherry MP7. The Cherry skin is... I think the Cherry skin is on all weapons in the blue category. There are some rare Cherry skins. I think there's a Karambit knife that was Cherry, and I think I have it in my inventory as well. I saw the Sumber Scar again. Was that what that was, or was it the Lee Enfield? It was a Lee Enfield. It looked like the same as a Sunburst Scar. Six more crates to open. There's that Lee Enfield again. I do already have that. We won't be getting it. Blue Granite M1 Carbine. Five more crates to open. Another blue and green. The Fall Camo UMP5. Another blue and green crate. The Mosey RPK. I am not an RPK user. I think we've already mentioned that in this video. Saw another ice weapon there. Winchester? Oh no, it was a Cyber? Cyber Winchester and it was a snow whatever it was. Another blue and green crate. So that right there, that was a hundred crates. So we can open up one more in the game. Do I see a mythic? We do not get a mythic inside of this opening. So that was a hundred and one crates that we opened inside of zombie stories. And for the 1% chance to get a mythical, we didn't get a mythical, but we did get three rares, which I said pretty much equals to a low tier mythic. So it kind of is, eh, it's kind of telling the truth. But let's go to uh, what we really want to do and combine everything. We should be getting a bunch. Let's go with the greens first. Um, I don't use any green weapons, so just start combining them. <laughs> Now, for the very fun part of the video, we get to combine all of these blues. All right, let's see what rare we get. I see a Jack Carbine in there. I would really like to get a Jack Carbine. Like I said, people love to overpay for that. We got the Cyber M14. Okay, I will definitely take that. All right. Another... Um, Jack Carbine. Ooh, two away from it. We got the Lightning Ultimix. That's really not... That's not too good. But again, it is a rare, so I will take it. For the third rare... I don't see a Jack Carbine in this one. That is the big bucks right now. If we get a Jack Carbine, that's the big bucks. Shattered Mine RPK. That's uh, decent. This is the fourth rare for combining. The Sunburst Scar, that's all right as well. I think people like the lighting effect on that, so that's the only reason someone would probably trade for it. Okay. An Ice AK-12. Also saw that a lot inside of the crate opening. This is the fifth rare for combining.
Candy Girl MP7? I think that's what that is. People like the Candy Girl skins. So that I will take. All right, combine. This is the sixth rare. I see that cyber, or not the cyber. What is the gamma ray MP5? There's two of them in there. We were one away. We got right in the middle between two gamma rays. Uh, we got the void M14, and I already have three of those, I'm pretty sure. This is the, I think this is the seventh rare for combining. The hot rod ultimix that I think is too rare. So that's a uh, triple or that's double the price right there. So this will be the last rare primary we can get. So that would be the eighth one, eighth or seventh one combining. I already lost track. My memory is bad. The cyber Winchester. I'll definitely take that as well. Okay, guys, so that is pretty much it for this video. Out of opening 100 plus crates, we opened up 101 crates inside of this game. We got three rares in just the unboxing portion, and then inside of the combining, we combined all of the greens into blues, and all of the blues into rares, and in total, we did seven or eight of those rares. It'll be on the screen right now exactly what we got, and then combine that with how many rares we actually unboxed. So we got a total of 10 plus rares out of 101 one box opening if you guys do want to see more unboxing videos to go ahead and test our luck let me know in the comment section down below this is my first time doing a video on something like this so i would love to go ahead and see your guys's feedback on whether or not you'd like to see more of this of course it does get a little bit fundy but please let me know your guys's opinions on it but anyways guys that's gonna be it for me my name is gmt and i will see you in the next one peace out guys